today I want to demonstrate my asteroids work in progress uh, basic program on my 4054A computer and uh, we'll be showing generating these graphics objects uh, each of the player ship rotations and asteroids. So currently the program drew those images and recorded them as different object numbers in the graphics engine uh, inside this Tektronix computer. The blinking cursor is in the middle of the last asteroid on the right, uh, shape 4, the large shape, uh, because I've generated all the objects centered on the zero point uh, in the middle of the object. Uh, and I've also got a piece of uh, the program that hasn't been run yet. So let's list uh, an animation program that I've added. So I'm going to home the cursor to the left side of the screen and list my short animation program. So I've started that animation program at line 10,000. And as you can see, it's very short. It consists of changing the XY coordinate of an object with this ST point command you see starting on line 10020. The set point 102 says change object 102, which is actually the second asteroid of the 100 series, and move it to a new location. And you can see these variables J with increments. And so this program is going to loop and change the J value, which is going to move X and Y uh, in different directions, just to show the fact that this board can animate these objects as though they were sprites, vector sprites. So if we run, ah, try again, run line 10,000, then we will see some of these asteroids move to the middle of the screen and then begin moving in different directions. How about that? Looks like the program's working. There is no visible flicker. I hope the video doesn't show flicker. Uh, but you can see different asteroids have been moving in different directions and everything else is uh, stable. So I should be able to create a very good asteroids uh, clone with my basic program.